Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Nate Casts. We've got ourselves a PvP. I'm not going to tell you who submitted this. In the top right, we have the red Protoss player. He is Old Greg. You ever drank Bailey's out of an old shoe? His opponent in the Southwest, the blue Protoss player. He is Tider D. The D-E at the end of a name is usually your way of telling someone that you are German, right? D-E. I always see that for stuff. Um, and yeah, interested to see what happens here. Okay, there you go. Old Greg is going to bring out a forge. If you guys don't know Old Greg, I highly suggest you make sure there are no children around you and you search it on YouTube. Not because it's NSFW, but it is on the creepier side of stuff you're gonna see on the internet personally i think it's great but uh yeah yeah viewer discretion is advised okay old greg's gonna drop three four pylons he's basically saying you have to cancel your gateways to save yourself dude this is some jigsaw level shit. he's like you you spent your whole life building gateways to wall off now the only way through this wall is to cancel your own but he's gonna finish his gate and try to chrono out the zealot Photon cannon number one is inbound. Probes are being pulled to try and take down the pylons on the front of the line. Back back pylon by Tyler to try and cover the left side if he can get it. There's one other pylon here. Can the Zealot actually take out the cannon on its own once it's halfway past building? I'm not sure. Second photon cannon is going to start up now. The probes are hacking and whacking and smacking. There's the Zealot trying to chop that meat. Another photon cannon does get started behind the, the first one. It's tucked back just a little bit further. My girlfriend is in the chat saying, Nate showed me old Greg and I will never forgive him. That's right. Katie, I made you a better human being, and I really can't wait to uh, drink Bailey's out of an old shoe with you one day. So it looks like this cannon rush is not actually getting as much as they were hoping for, but no additional zealots were made. So once the zealot is dead, surely these two cannons can get some work done on their own. Oh my god, the probe gets the coup de gras. Wow. Well, you know what he says? It, you're not building anything. I'm going to build more cannons. Keep the probes here keep the probes. Need. Old Greg is definitely going to need a cannon on the low ground to secure his position here. Usually getting out a stalker brings the end of it. Yeah, Old Greg's building another cannon right inside. So these probes spend all that time trying to hit the cannon. But three of them, you need three. You need three on a cannon once it starts to stop it from finishing. Unfortunately, this one is way too close to finishing. Oh, wait, no. He got the zealot in the back. I got the zealot in the back. Laser hands go smack. Probes are trying to help, but the cannons got me squelched. Sorry. I'm not a rapper. Maybe one day. Okay, this is the cannon that finishes with full health. So, old Greg's getting to work. Honestly, I almost feel like... I guess killing the Zealot is still really important, but... I almost feel like you want to just try to target down more probes in this situation. The Stalker's about to come in. Is he going to try to wall the Stalker inside here? Is that the play? Because the Stalker's out now. Now, people usually try to use, like, a defensive shield battery. Yeah, he's probably going to put one here. It's usually, like, a defensive shield battery... And you try to use the rotation to just restore shields on the stalker, poke away at the cannon. Restore shields on stalker, poke away at cannon. But as you can see, he's like, okay, I'm just going to take my probes, dive on top of this photon cannon, use the stalker to help break it down. And that part is working for sure. He's killed a lot of probes, but he didn't focus down the stalkers. He said to himself, all right, this is fine. I'm going to just chill like this. This cannon, these cannons are probably going to get canceled, but he's he needs to buy some time for himself if we're being honest with ourselves here because... He ain't got at home. He didn't even have a gateway. He had no gas. He's just going to build three more cannons. Okay, you crazy son of a Show me what you got. That one gets canceled. And I guess what he's thinking to himself is, you're just not going to be able to kill all the cannons fast enough, and I'm still going to get your gateways and your cybernetics core. Now, Tyler... I'm just going to call him Tyler. Tyler did not build a shield battery. So he doesn't have any way to rotate the stalkers to keep him healthy. And old Greg, he's just going to keep building more photon cannons because he knows two stalkers don't have the DPS to actually kill the ones that he's trying to warp in. He's staggering them forward. And honestly, with the amount of income that he has on one base, he's, he's doing just fine. Tyler is broke because he actually has probes mining gas. He only has eight guys on minerals. Oh, 29 of 30. It was so close. No warp gate either. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Old Greg's totally going to win this, right? Tider just never got anything out of there. He never he never actually, like, put anything together. 
and now he's 100 percent gonna have his warp gate canceled like these stalkers should keep the nexus safe so it shouldn't it shouldn't end but this is where old greg needs to build a gateway yep there we go old greg's getting a gateway he's taking gas he knows what's what this was as much as he could get and he got it he got all of it cybernetic score will have to be restarted but he shouldn't end up being too far too much further ahead uh of old greg on all of that Getting this probe earlier would have been nice too. Wow. 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 There we go. Don't worry. There's a backup probe. Oh, Greg's got a big ball of t sitting in the back room. He's going to get the funk out. Yeah. Trying to bounce between with the shield regen is tricky though, especially because he doesn't have a shield battery. Yeah. These stalkers are getting beat up. The stalkers are getting beat up. He's boxed, in, boxed inside. Now, what's old Greg going for at home? Get your cyber core, boy. There you go. There you go. You got to get that ball of funk. You got to get the funk. Do you love me? Are you playing your love games with me? Robotics facility is a pretty good way out of here. Because he's, he's much further ahead, right? Like, Tyler still has a pretty good amount of a lead when it comes to warp gate and i think you get an immortal out and you could pretty much you could bash this down i think i think the immortal is going to break you out of here just fine honestly maybe wait for two immortals but this is what you want to do just rotate as they get through the shields just shoot you're over microing it now pull this one off there you go there you go no no ease it gently there you there you go that's the way you do it Get your money for nothing and your chicks for free. Start warp gate, old Greg. He's getting a prism and his warp gate's almost done. Yo, Tyler could win this game still. Could you learn to love me? I, perhaps in this light. <laughs> I could love you, old Greg. I could learn to love you. You're just saying that. Oh my god. He's gonna build all of his stuff here too? Oh my god. He says, I don't need warp gate, dog. I'm just going to build more stuff outside of your base. Okay. Well, he's just going to build immortals outside of his base, I guess. Tyler, Tyler did get... Oh, look at that. I love that he's taking the probe out. Is he just going to try to expand? Ooh, Pog EX. He's putting batteries below tier two. What on earth? I love that he, he built a cannon to defend the robo. This is not going to be an easy shutdown by any means because he's going to have the immortal. This battery might get canceled, but it's not the end of the world. Good. Oh, the shield battery, the probe. No. Well, the probe died, but these stalkers are boxing themselves in. Good pickup, good pickup, good pickup, good pickup, good pickup. You got to get across the map, Doc. Did he build anything here? Okay, he's got one cannon in his main mineral line. There's the immortal. I love it when you call me Big Papa. But see, this is really dangerous because this immortal has several cannons to fall back to. And still, the shield batteries. What a game, ladies and gentlemen. Where's the other cannon? Oh, he's getting the second one at home because he saw the prism. He's going to have to expand eventually, though. Taking out the gas. He's got a thousand gas in the bank, dog. This is not what you want to kill, old Greg. I'm old Greg. Yeah, I know. You've said it about 40 times. I got a man. Ah. Well, he's certainly trying to show it to Tyler. I apologize to everybody who accidentally watched this with a kid nearby. This broke me. I just got to watch old Greg Cannon rush the crap out of a Protoss player. And honestly, it's everything I ever wanted and more. And I still have no idea who's going to win. This is still way too close to call. Tyler's micro has been getting better. But old Greg's got immortals in his base. He did kill the one immortal, I guess. Huh. Immortal versus immortal and cannons. No! Oh, Tyler. Oh, boy. Oh, my sweet baby boy. Oh, the prism. The bomb. A bad man. Save the prism. Save the girl. Save the cheerleader. Save the world. Oh, that immortal. He's He's got a few one taps now. Just tap it in. No, Greg. Old Greg lost another immortal. But he's got the cannons to back it up. He's got the cannons. He's got the cannons. Old Greg. 
my man. What truly blows my mind is he got the probe out with the prism earlier, but he hasn't expanded. I would take a corner base right now if I was Tyler. Take a corner base, dump your gas into sentries, try to force field these guys away from the cannons, right? Because he's got a thousand gas. But both of these players are going to mine out their main bases. And that's actually good for old Greg because he's got more than one base. But now there's two immortals for Tyler. Oh, God. I, I would get Prism. Oh, unpower the robo. That's cute. That's cute. This is a good spot to play around. Just having all the cannons here. Although if I were, if I was to be even crazy hypercritical, maybe try to get another battery over here or two. Look at the income levels. Both players are just running out of money. Losing mineral patches. Oop, oop, oop. Stalker. Good grab. Old Greg built a zealot. He built two zealots. Did old Greg ever get warp gate? No. It's a waste of money when you're building all your stuff in your opponent's base. There's no need for warp gate. You're already there. You can warp in anywhere. Yeah, but what if I wanted to warp in my opponent's base? You could do that. Yeah, but what if I just saved the 50-50 and just built everything in their base? What are you talking about? You know what, guys? I can cast probably the rest of this game just doing this. No! What is this probe doing? Tyler. No! Did you just... Uh... What an <gasps> idiot. What an idiot. And he's going to push into the cannons and die now, I guess. Oh, my God. That was it. That was all he had. Is old Greg building two Stargates? Nani! Oh, he didn't spend any of his gas, really. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Is he just gonna build Phoenix and kill him now? Or Void Rays? I guess Void Rays would probably be the the dank way to end this. If your name is old Greg, you don't go double Stargate Phoenix to try and secure the win, right? Do you? Yeah, that's my boy. Alright. And Tyler's gonna finally push a lot of these cannons off of him. I don't think he's going to lose any of his immortals here either. Very well done by our blue Protoss player. However, he's running out of money. And, well, I guess none of this really matters anymore since he's just going to go for the old, uh, the, the, just the Void Rays follow. <laughs> uh, this is a dumpster fire of a game. Good God. I honestly, I'm going to need a shower after this one, boys. I'm going to need a shower. I'm really glad they fixed the shower in the guest room because I'm going to need a long shower. All right, Katie, you can you can use the, the main. You can use the master bathroom now that the, now that the guest one's working. I'm going to I'm just going to take a really long hot bath. And uh, if you find me drowning myself with this replay on in front of me, I apologize. Need to shower the old Greg. Well, I'll be honest with you. I don't think it's possible to clean old Greg. He's so broke. He literally. Oh. There's no minerals left. There's enough minerals left in this base for like, I think three or four void rays max now. And there's a good number of stalkers coming. Uh, he's going to try to hold at the front too. He's going to let all this die. It could work. Oh, I don't know. I don't think two void rays is enough. The third one could be the balance tipper. He does have a battery. Batteries are important, but look at Tyler. He built another Nexus. I think old Greg is super dead. I'm sorry, guys. I don't I don't know how old Greg brings us back. He did get another Nexus. I imagine he's going to recall some workers. Oh, the hallucinated Colossus. Ay, ay, ay. Recall. Recall your probes. There you go. There you go. All right. It's time. It's time to nut up or shut up. Void Rays activating their lasers. I'm a power in my laser. Boop. And they're going to kill everything. Holy sh**. Well, is old Greg going to win? <laughs> I'm old Greg. I guess that's what it's going to be. Oh, no, the prison. <laughs> and no. no. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, old Greg's totally going to win this game. Hell yeah. Oh, this is some funny sh**, man. <laughs> Top 10 anime betrayal. I didn't even need a beep there. 
Why would I beep the word anime? I have no idea. Oh my god. Old Greg, I need every replay of every game you've ever played because... Oh, man. Oh my god, this is some quality garbage right here. There we go, he's gonna fire his lasers one more time. Two stalkers dead, number three down. He did kill one of the Void Rays. He's trying to micro, but ladies and gentlemen, here's a fast fact since this game's been such a shit show. Did you know that the Void Rays range is six, but once it starts attacking a unit, as long as the unit doesn't go further than eight range away, the Void Ray can keep shooting it. The Void Ray's attack goes up to eight range the moment that it starts hitting a unit. And the Void Ray can also shoot while moving if the unit runs directly away in a straight line. It's true. It's true. Void Rays can follow an attack uh, in situations such as that. He's going to build third Stargate because why would he try to close the game out yet? I'm surprised he didn't try to kill the probes here or anything. There wasn't really much. He's going to need a lot of Void Rays. He's going to need a lot of Void Rays to kill him with this. I, I don't know, man. Is he getting a third Stargate? Yeah, he is. I... Yeah, you know... I... Power up your cyber core and get plus one for those void rays, you filthy s Do it. Alright, the void ray hit squad is coming, guys. Ooh, he's looking for the he's looking for the other base. He's gonna find it. Ring. You're gonna try to power up your opponent's gateway. This isn't the campaign, dog. That'd be pretty cool though if you could. Well, here's the thing. Blink is almost done, but it's not right. These five void rays could probably kill this nexus right now and recall out. If I'm being honest, I think he could actually do it. Here we go! That's exactly what he's going to be. Prismatic alignment is activated. That plus six damage versus armor. He says, oh, you still have some stalkers here? No problem, bruh. I'll kill those and then get to work on the next. Bion, bion. Look how fast that damage comes in. Bion, 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 bion. Heimdall, bring us back! There you go. And he recalled to this one too, which I think is still a little bit dangerous. But now he's got to build a bunch of shield batteries here because there's only one thing for Tyler to do. Now that his only mining base got sniped. Only one thing to do. Why would you rebuild it here? This I don't understand. Why not just take your natural that actually has more resource? Whatever. It's a bunch of blink stalkers. And they should win this fight. But. Oh, three more void rays are coming. I mean, seven void rays with prismatic alignment and five shield batteries. I think they could win this. It really just comes down to the archons and the immortals doing enough lifting against the batteries, I suppose. Do you pull probes? I don't know. There we go. He's charging up his laser beam. Shield batteries are coming online. So void rays are trying to do their best to stay in the fight. We still have six void rays alive and the stalker count is dropping. I'm old Greg. It's beautiful. This is like one of those movies. This, this is like my bird box moment. Blood's just dripping down my eyes after casting this game. And uh, now I'm dead. GG.